hello my beautiful and lovely subscribers welcome back to my youtube channel okay as you can see this beautiful girly fascinator is what you are going to learn on this channel today please like subscribe to my videos subscribe and share my link to your friends to like comment also subscribe to my channel and view thanks to you all for being on my channel okay um, the first thing i'm going to do right now i'm going to show you the materials like you need first of all you need your gilly which is the ultimate material for this design and then the flowers on the table depend on the flower you want to use anyway you can make your own flowers or you can get the kind you want you need your lighter your already wrapped band if you check my previous videos you see the one i already wrapped the band so you learn from there if you don't know how to wrap your band so this one we need just one piece of the gilly first the gilly you can get some this is 600 some place i'm wondering and then i'm going to cut it out like that i'll measure 5.5 on the gilly i mean the ashuki on the ashuki yes 5.5 on the ashuki and cut it out i'll keep measuring like that until i get to about 10 pieces or more depending on how many your gilly your shuki is going to give to you so you keep cutting after you cut out the first one you please the, the first one on the nest and you keep cutting it until you're done okay now i'm done cutting out the pieces and this is almost 10 that we have here so the next thing for you to do you just trade your you first of all you see the way i'm going to trim out the flower sorry the leaf out of it you're going to fold into two like that and then you put your scissors from the beginning like that and then you try to cough your hand while going downward and then you cut it to the end now you can see the flower the, um, the leaf has formed already that's how you form your leaf okay this is how you form your leaf as needle and then after you keep doing that to the rest of the um ashiki you've cut out like the 5.5 you've cut out on all of them you just keep cutting it like that to the end on all of them until you show you've gotten the complete 10 numbers of the one you want to use to make your fascinator so keep learning please subscribe to my channel if you've not done so thanks to all my return subscribers love you all kisses to you all love you love you love you all okay here i am done almost cutting it all here i'm done cutting everything so the next thing for me to do after cutting out like this I've, i think they are up to 10 pieces here i'm going to put the my use the color the same color first of all you're supposed to burn the edges with your lighter like that some people do weave it you can take it to your weaving machine if you have one weave the edges round or you burn the tips like that if you can't weave it you burn it so your your gilly will stay you know gilly frees out a lot so the next thing for you to do is to print it at the bottom like that not from the leaf part at the bottom like this and then you tack it together use your trade and needle use the same color while working on this design because you are going to there's a way you are going to place it on the band it's going to actually stand not lying down it will just stand like the one the way you saw it on the first picture and video before the tutorials so you keep tacking it until your nose is thin and it's perfect before you now keep it on the ground and then you pick the next one after dropping this you pick the next one and you keep tacking it until you get to the end of them or like you tack all of them you all the ten of it so you keep tacking tack 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 as fast as you can as fast as my video is so you keep tacking like that until you get to the end of the tacking when you're done tack um tacking all of them like this swing so we call it swing but in millinery we call it tacking now the next thing for you to do is to put your gum 
are the tips of where you tack it and then you gum it like that look at the way i'm putting the gum and then you gum it to your band straight well just keep stand it straight make sure you keep it properly you do the same thing place them from the beginning of the band to the the other part but not to the end but if you want to make it to the end part is that also your own um signature work but if you want to learn from my own you, you just please it to one side like the one you saw on the video or the picture before we got to the tutorials so you please it like that thanks for following me to this part so we are getting to the end thanks for watching please love react like subscribe and share my videos to your friends we targeted 1k subscribers this month well there's still hope that we can still reach 1k subscribers so you see the way i'm pleasing the the already soon already tag ashoki on the band just like that is it already uh soon leave uh, we already used the ashoki to make a leave right <laughs> so I'm done, right? And I'm done gumming all of them like that. Sometimes you can use your, depend on with the gum, the kind of gum you use. You can use your trade and needle to secure it to the band, secure it. Then after that, you start putting your flowers to cover the rough part of your work, just like that. You put your flower. You make sure you place your hand. When you show the flower is properly stick to the band, then you can now remove your hand. And then those other ones are small, small flowers and that. You can use the small ones all through. You can decide to use the bigger ones all through. So you put the gum on the band. Sorry, on the flowers. And then you stick it to the rough part of your work. So that it will look very neat. And no one will know exactly the way you design your headwears. And your clients will love it when they see that you give them a good finishing. Finishing is the most important thing when it comes to millinery work. Whenever you're working, make sure you use flowers feathers to and give it a good embellishment embellish it in such a way that it will entice your clients and they will refer others people other people to you so it's all about the finishing part of the work that is the real deal thanks for watching my video i love you all bye bye